As we know, Bengaluru came into prominence after Kempe Kaura envisioned it. The fort and the petes gave a formal structure to this settlement, while the surrounding villages still remain distinct. The growth of trees was restricted to the groves that were spread out around temples and common areas of villages. Even though the climate in this region was cooler than the rest of the Deccan Plateau, planting of trees was not very widespread. To raise a garden of Lalbakh's proportions, Tipu Sultan imported seeds from various parts of the world. Even today, you will hear that the plants and trees here and in other parts of Bengaluru hail from distant places like Africa, Australia, China, Europe and South and North Americas. Tree planting was passionately continued all across the city during the decades that followed to earn Bengaluru the nickname of the Garden City of India. Today, 2150 species of plants belonging to 673 genera and a 140 families call Lalbagh as their home.